We're standing here with Jessica Padilla and uh, new Yamamoto nutrition athlete and eighth place here. You finished yes. in the figure Olympia. Very tough lineup. Yeah, I know. It's like I never, you know, expected. But um, I did. I think that I did my job, and I'm really happy with my eighth place. I'm going to give you a compliment because if this was five or six or seven years ago. I might be talking to the winner right now. So the oh competition God. has really gotten much, much better over the last couple of years. And you've raised your game and, and you're just, you're on the rise right now. Yeah, I know. It's like I have been like working and improving myself. And I'm taking every advice that you guys that knows about bodybuilding um, give it to me so I'm just like listening to the experts and changing all the all the things that I need to be improved so it, it, it works so I'm surprised about myself even though because it's like I have been like changing I'm improving and getting better and better and that's part of this of course it is but now you're also linked up with a nutrition company like Yamamoto who believes in you uh, you know, it, it's exciting when some company actually comes to you and wants to sign you. Yeah. What did it mean to you when you when you were approached by them? Oh my God, um, it means a lot. I have been doing this since 2013, and um, I have been doing it by my own. So it's really hard. People that that uh, do this know how expensive it is and how sacrificed it is. And I'm a single mother, and I have been doing this for almost four years by myself. So can you imagine now having like them, like Gemma Mother Nutrition helping me out, I know that I'm gonna do so much better because I don't have to be working an eight hours full-time job and being a single mother and doing this. I, I always say, I always say women are much better than men. I, I'm, I'm not a single parent and, 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 and my wife does 98% of everything for my son and it's still very difficult so I understand where you're coming from it's got to be a huge burden off of you yeah it's really hard I have to wake up early go to my job um, have my clients at the gym work out and then do my meals like prepare everything and it's it's hard but it's possible that, like if you really love it and you're passionate about it and um, you have like people around you who motivates you to keep going and pushing yourself to the limits and now I'm just like living a dream come true. I tell everyone, if you have a passion, stick to it. You'll make it work. You'll find a way because you love what you do. Yeah, I really love it. It's like you need to love it because it's, it's not easy. That's why like not everybody could do it. But if you're really passionate about it and you really like are disciplined and have self-control and you believe in yourself, I know that you could get whenever you want and in the place that you really want to be. All right, let's see the physique. Show it off. One day removed from the Olympia stage. Do you give us your quarter turns here? Unbelievable. What, what a bunch of, we've seen some amazing physiques up here that, that I've been interviewing. Nathan will be the next one when he, oh, he's here in the, in the wings. Um, there's some great, talk about genetics on this, uh, on this Yamamoto nutrition stage here. Unbelievable. Congratulations on eighth place, and uh, I know we're going to see much higher places in the future. Oh, for sure. You know that. So keep watching me because it's so much more about Jessica Reyes. I'm from Puerto Rico for next year. You will see. Now, let me ask you something about your name because I know that all the Spanish people, because I have Johnny who works for me, you all have two names. You have your mother's last name and your father's last name. Which one do you use? Well, I use both because I have a mother and I have a father. Right. So I represent both of us, right. both of them. So my name is Jessica Reyes Padilla. Now Reyes is your dad's name, right? Yes, and um, Padilla is my mom's. But most people don't know, they don't understand that. So most people call you Jessica Padilla like I did, but yeah. I, and I actually know better, <laughs> but you use both because you're honoring them both. Yeah, of course, like that means a lot for me and they put 50 and 50, so that's why I am look like this. There you go, it doesn't get much better than that. Congratulations once again. Thank you, Dave.